Hey guys. So I'm just gonna, I know I haven't done a video for a few days, so I thought I'd do um, one tonight. It's about quarter to seven and I'm gonna use to settle down for the night. Well, she's been in a lot of pain for the past two days, that's why, well, since she's had her operation really. Um, and she had, a, she had to have an x-ray yesterday and then a, um, a scan today. So I'm waiting on the results for that. Um, absolutely drained because I'm on, obviously I'm on children's world and everyone's noisy and I've got the worst headache ever and I'm feeling a bit pretty down, I'm feeling a bit low because I don't know what to do for the best um, with Olivia because she doesn't want me to help her. I mean, I don't know whether she thinks I'm going to hurt her when I move her or, or what. And that machine that keeps going off. Can you hear it, guys? I mean, I'm actually in the recliner just now watching a bit of TV before all the lights turned down, so I thought I'd do a quick video. And that machine has been going on and off all day, and it's giving me one hell of a headache, and as is Olivia as well. We're going feel sick and I'm gonna be sick, I'm gonna be sick. And no, that's all I've heard today. <laughs> well I've heard that for the past few days but I feel sorry for her because sorry if you hear a lot of noise it's staff in the background. Because it's getting pretty busy up here. Well I got told we were supposed to be getting discharged today but because of how Olivia's been they cannot do a stop well a flu a hair sperm. So if anyone doesn't know that Olivia had a stoma bag back in two thousand seventeen and Friday just gone, she had a reversal so she don't no longer has a bag, she has them like an ace button. But they can't use that ace button just yet because she's in so much pain and she's keeps she keeps throwing up. And I got a phobia sick. How I've managed it without throwing up myself I, is beyond me and you know she made a comment today she goes why does it have to be me why why me I felt really bad sorry that was a nurse coming in to sort that living noise out <laughs> so today's Wednesday so tomorrow I'm gonna go home for a bit to do some washing thank you Oh, sorry, that was the nurse again putting um, the drip on. She's got she's on pain relief drip, paracetamol and some fluids. Plus she can't take medication in her mouth. Now yesterday um what you call it what you call them trainees nurse or something a student nurse yeah she come into Olivia because she was like hey, hey. and then she just made a comment and I thought it was quite disrespectful if she, you know really they should be reading notes or asking the mentor if the child has any other needs which Olivia does and just she made a comment yesterday goes well I'll teach you not to take your medicine in the morning water I'm like um She's got phobia medicine. Why would I, I just looked in disgust and then I had to, I had to say to the, the one that's training her because I thought it was disrespectful. Especially when someone's got a phobia, you know what I mean? She's got phobia needles, blood, and since it's for three more bowels, she will not take medication. So, and I'll manage to get blood to the I want out. Well, you know, Paul Lass is going through hell and back right now. They took the back to, you know, IVs in her left hand, the crease of where your elbow is, the side of the arm, then they've had to do the other arm because the needle kept blowing the vein. And Paul Lass just was shouting that much because she was in a lot of pain. Sorry. Um, she was so much pain yesterday that 
she fell asleep. I thought she got knackered. Um, but yeah, I think if it isn't, if it, I didn't have my medication, and I, I think not last night, the night before, I slept right through. I think because I didn't have uh, blooming thing. <laughs> and if you know, it's when I don't. And I, that's why I've got to go home tomorrow as well to pick up my medication. Otherwise, I'm going to go a bit schizo. Not meaning like that, I'm just saying it as a make, trying to make myself laugh. <laughs> but yeah, I need that because if I don't, my mental health will deteriorate. And I'm already feeling a bit down in the dumps. And I don't know if that's tightness. Ooh. Sorry, I don't know where that would come from. I don't know if it's tiredness, I just feel mentally drained or I feel physically drained as well because I just feel like she's just, whatever I try to do to help her, she's just pushing me away and I feel like a spare wheel. She'd rather have the nurses do it and then I, I, I get paranoid what the nurses are thinking and you know, is it, why can't you do it yourself because he's the, the other one, yeah, he's a bit of a and not so nice. Had a lovely nurse today. Oh, this machine going up again. <laughs> anyway, I'm not really complaining. You know, I just, had, I just felt like I just needed to come along and just the day because obviously I had to deal with Olivia for the past two days. Not deal, with, but you know what I mean. I had to support her. I went out for a little walk today to Primark and got. Or a 90 and some underwear just so I can get home so it can last till I get home tomorrow to do the wash, dry and bring it back. Oh, I swear. <laughs> I bought some donuts earlier because I thought that might persuade her to heat because since Friday, the 23rd, she's not eating. She's had a little tiny bits of bread with ham in it but she's pukes it back up keep trying to give her like fruit shoots because she won't drink water sips of that and then it, after a bit it comes back up she's not keeping anything down and with a back reversal she's not gonna poop since friday morning so you can imagine the pain that's gonna cause when she has to go to the toilet on, with a normal bum so I think we're starting that tomorrow on the show and I'm hoping we get on soon because it's costing me a fortune in this hospital. The meals are expensive, the drinks are well free on the ward if you've got milk, if you don't have milk then it's like £2 a cup and then if you fancy a bit of cake, it's like no three quick because it's like a costa. I went to the shop earlier to buy a sandwich and that was two pounds something. I'm like, how much? That was for a ham sandwich, plain ham sandwich. Pot, I got a pot noodle. No, super noodle, pot noodle. But I was gonna have that, but Libby was gonna have a sandwich. She took a bite and threw it back up and did one else so I just set the sandwich. Um, oh, I got that. No, I didn't. I ate that earlier. I look, I'm into dime bars at the minute. So, kind of fancy one of them. But also, the internet's not great here, so I don't know how long it's going to take me to download this video and put it up. But I'm going to go anyway, guys, because I'm feeling a bit, a bit down tonight and tired and I think tonight's going to be an early night so yeah I hope she goes on gets to come on soon so that's that really I'm going to go and see my doggy and see what my house is like tomorrow with two 20 year olds in the house you can only imagine that it's not being kept tidy what's that Sorry, it's someone news. Anyway, guys, I'm going to go because my son's trying to message me at the same time as me talking to you guys. So I'm going to love you and leave you. If you, don't, if you like this video, press like, subscribe, and press that notification button, and I'll catch up with you later. Night, night. Bye, bye.